Hey, JB here with another video for you. I uh, just got into the brick kiln and brought these with me. I uh, got home from work today and these were at my house. It's my drawer units. I'm very excited to get these up and uh, see what that section looks like when I finish up. So I was opening up all the drawer units and I noticed that this one has some damage to it. Drawer split on the side and that crack goes all the way back. It looks like it goes all the way across. The, uh, yeah, all the way to the back. Let's see if we can get that to focus. It focused and then immediately broke the focus, whatever. And then it's also got a crack here on the side. So uh, I've contacted the company to see if I can get a refund or a replacement for this drawer unit. So we shall see what they say. So we've got three columns of basically five 30 drawer units. So that's 450 drawers and then three sets of the nine large drawers of so 27 of those. So that's 477 more drawers added to my store. So I need to get all these drawers labeled and then I've got stuff to part out and plenty of used stuff to put in. And then I've still got two more of the large units and two more of the small units and the broken one left. So um, I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it like this. I like it. It looks nice. Um, I might take two of these 30 units out or like, two all the way across and put the, uh, combination units in there just so I can have kind of a mix, more of a mix. Cause I feel like I'm going to need more large drawers than that once I start really breaking into this bulk cause I have some very large pieces in here that I need to get to. Oh, and I haven't shown this yet, but I stopped at Walmart the other day and found one set worth buying, and it was the Avengers Advent Calendar for 10 bucks. So, very nice deal. Oh, and can somebody tell me what on earth Spider-Man is supposed to have in his hand? I, mean, I cannot figure out what that is supposed to be. Let me know in the comments if you if you know what that's supposed to be. Oh yeah. So um, like I was saying I got some large pieces in these bags, containers that need to get uploaded. I found this in one of the, my bulk lots, and I'm like, oh, that's from Django Fett's uh, Slave One, and it's all scratched up. And then I looked it up, and it's not really worth anything anyway. So um, this is gonna go in my second spin. These are just pieces that physically are, I mean, they're still buildable, but like they're badly discolored or they're just worn out. Some of these aren't all that bad. I just kind of threw all these basic bricks in there from one lot because I didn't feel like taking the time to figure out what was wrong with some of them. And I know a good number of them are just worn, so. Well, I just got back from eating dinner and uh, I've got one of my largest orders so far this year. I picked this before I left and this is everything except for two pieces. And while my wife was out earlier, she went to Target and found some sets that were on sale. And I asked her to pick up a copy of this set because I'm missing those two 
inverted slopes there for my store. So I've been meaning to pick up this set anyway for myself because I want that Darth Maul or just Maul figure. <laughs> and uh, I figured I'd part everything else out and get those two pieces while I'm at it. And then while she's at Target, I found three copies of the Stunt Show set. Uh, this one doesn't have a sticker on it. Oh, there it is. For $50.99. So 50% 50 off, basically. So. Some interesting pieces. I know that windshield there is popular. And these uh, track pieces are good. So. I figured I might as well go for it and get, get three of them. And just part them all out. So that's a pretty nice little little haul there. I had some other Star Wars sets that were on a slight sale with the gift cards, but uh, yeah, I didn't didn't go for that. Oh, the Cyber Beast. I feel like that's a set from the '90s. Yeah, I looked it up. Cyber Beast isn't a set, but there are some sets from the '90s that there's like Cyber Stinger, Cyber Strikers, and a few sets like that. So um. Could be a reference to that because the purplish color, I know it's magenta now, but it looks very similar to that purple color they used in those 90 sets. So, uh, could be a little bit of a hint, to, not a hint, but a reference to that. So, anyway, definitely some cool pieces in this set, including this black tile piece, the like 8 by 16 tile. That's a good piece. I'm interested to see these uh, stunt flywheel pieces as well because I haven't actually looked at those pieces yet there we go got to get that piece and that piece and we're good to go so i went ahead and put the remaining drawer units over here i just set the broken one up here for right now um i didn't email them and they've already asked me for some more information and i sent that so uh we'll see what they say about replacement for this broken unit um Yeah, but uh, just getting an idea for what it could look like in the future with coming out farther this way. I, I won't be using this board in the future, just got it there temporarily. But uh, yeah. Oh, and I also parted out that uh, dual Mandalore set and got the rest of those pieces uploaded. So uh, yeah, that is going to wrap up the video for tonight so thanks for watching and until next time y'all have a good one